Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 19. So, you might be wondering why the screen is black at first. Now, we sort of have a bit, bit of a problem when it comes to recording. Um, whenever I uh, start the game, like so, I have the steering wheel enabled, but as soon as I switch out of the game to to start a recorder, the OBS software, um, it switches off my steering wheel. So it's like, I have to start the recording before I start a game, otherwise I won't have the steering wheel enabled. And that just happened after the up last update, I have no idea why. But it did, and it, it sucks. But I can't do much about it now, maybe it will fi be fixed in another the update, I don't know. It just it seems like it lo loses. Um, whenever I start the game, uh, I start my computer, the, um, the steering wheel is sort of in a locked position. Um, but, um, and that happens when I switch the game between different windows now. Suddenly it, it just locks it, which is sort of annoying. Anyway, today we're going to go and sell some eggs, that's my plan. Um, I also built this over here, which is, the link is to this, and link to this is in the description. It's a placeable um, equestrian track, whatever you want to call it. Um, the reason why it's here is because um, my, uh, my fiance is helping me with my horses. And Blixton, I think that's probably Blixton is probably oh zero. So, so my fiance is helping me, which is greatly appreciated because it takes a lot less time to run, do the horses and, sh and stuff. Um, but she got kind of bored of just running around the track and the, the map and exploring it. So, she wanted something like this, and I was like, because she <laughs> she was playing while I was at work one day. And, and and she found, on Ravenport, she found one of these tracks. I think there's one by default on that map, but not on, not on uh, the Felsbrand map. So she tried it out and it's like, oh, there's a place you can run around the ho horses and jump with them. And it's like, yes. Uh, and I looked, I found this. Um, placeable so I went like oh I can fix that for a map so I had to sacrifice a bit of um, arable land though but um, it's not that fun either but it, it's a change if you want to run around the horses you can do that a little bit more f fun in a bit more fun way than before so link to this is in the description if you want that um otherwise we we are working along on our horses which are this is our second generation of horses so I think we're up to like thirty seven thousand or so per horse Let's check that so yeah thirty seven thousand so that's one there's that's one that's less there but the ones are 37 so that's pretty awesome I a ton of work I guess if you had like a um, oh, what do you call it if you have a serve map which you're on a server and you can have a lot of people trying to help you then you could probably do this a lot faster. Horse, horses, if you had a lot of horses. And if you had a lot of, I mean, if you had, if you had eight people in, um, you would basically just need to do this for ten minutes with a horse. So then you get out like sixteen horses and we're like twenty minutes per person a day, so in day game. So that's not a lot. Then you would probably move along quite fast. I do like the, this. The only thing, 
my fiance doesn't like about the horses is the jumping. They jump very unrealistically, she thinks. And there was something about um, the galloping. How the gallop. And this is why I have no idea. I do know pretty much nothing about horses, but apparently, when you, when you switch um, turn and turning, which way you turn is usually on horse, they gallop in a different way, different front legs. Th uh, they are trots, maybe. Here you can see. Oh, sorry. Going very well, is it? Um, so that was some, something else he noticed, which wasn't correct, but not a big deal. The gallops with the right leg first, right? See here? Which is realistic, she, she said. But uh, well, you don't run into things. Um, which is realistic, but usually when you turn different ways, it's different. Oh, we need to do some spraying here, actually. While I remember it. So, it, um, it should be slightly different on how you turn. I, I have no idea. She said that, so... We're just going to bring this up to 100% and then we're going to go I think we're going to go and set the spray in motion actually and spray the fields with herbicides because we had some weeds over there I saw It is a nice horse So there are 8 different kinds of horses on the map Otherwise this, I mean this motion is really cool they should have uh, be able to have a helmet though. Helmet and a riding vest we usually use over here. So, or at least the option to have one. Maybe a future implement for giants? I don't know. Yeah, you have no idea. So, 100%. Go leave this here. Where did it go? White hoops? Black hoops? Here it is. Don't want to clean it. So, uh, we need to spray our fields and then we're gonna go sell some eggs. What's the plan? Well, I ended up really close to my steering wheel. So we will destroy our crops a little bit by doing this, because we don't have any crop wheels. I've been thinking about in changing it to crop wheels, but I haven't, haven't done that. Maybe I should. We got some herbicide here. See, we destroy a little lane there. Raise the boom a bit. Like so. so we can actually just hire a worker to do that. No, oh, okay, we couldn't. Okay, and then we couldn't. And then we have to do it by manually. So we get some tram lines here. I think it's slightly big. It should be a little bit more narrow, but I guess that depends on how the plants are growing and that sort of stuff. So, but we do lose a little bit of crop here. Actually, we should probably just spray this area with weeds. Maybe. do the entire thing. So 
We seem to have weeds here. I don't know if this has some like PM P or just maybe we have weeds here too, but they're small so they can see them through the through foliage. Maybe that's the way it is. We'll, well, I don't know. We'll spray everything, I guess. So if we had copper wheels, this wouldn't destroy the crop so badly. Do you think when you spray with other stuff, it's not that bad? Destruction. Pretty wide boom anyway, so that's good. Doesn't destroy. Um, it, it's not too many tracks, I guess. Let's see where we're going. Everything is fun and nice. Missing a bit over here? No. No. Uh, so I'm doing a bit of contracting just to get us money and, and stuff, but. It's like a really worthless little piece of spray. Destroying that little crop here for this little row, but. I guess that's the way it has to go. If I combine, if I plow this little piece of land there in between the fields, that's, that's one way of, of getting rid of the problem. Then I at least have a little bit more land to harvest. I do miss, I do wish they, uh, hopefully they'll get a GPS mod out soon because that was a really good mod for FS17 and I do miss it a lot in FS19 so hopefully they'll get that out soon. So we'll see. Other field too. I do think it's cool that they actually, if you drive through the crops down there, they actually try to move. You boom. So you can turn on off the crop destruction if you want to. I think it's okay to have on. I think it's more realistic this way. Well, I do like realism in a way. So the idea to go sell this is is I mean basically we don't want to use the soybeans for anything, we're just gonna go sell them, so um not really my, my son drove a tractor into the field there that's why there's tracks over there if anyone is wondering I did not drive around I could. silly person over there my son did See that there's some, there were some weeds so down there actually. 
the ground. So I guess there, there are some weeds underneath all of this, this stuff which needs to be sprayed. So I guess it was good thing to spray the whole field, otherwise we would have gotten the weeds further along later. A little weird field when it comes to spraying, but... Yeah. Spray this already, but we'll go spray this bit here. Try to drive in my tracks here. Well, my son's tracks actually. Oh well. Now it's sprayed at least. There's a few mods I really miss. I did list Mr. GPS mod. Course play, not so much yet, because it's kind of fun to play this game, so I can, uh, can bear with not having course play. But I do miss GPS mod, and I do... I do meet Mr. GPS mod, as I said, and I do... would like to have the quick view mod because that was also very cool. Let's go here, let's go and grab this and then we'll go and sell some eggs. Because now we have a bunch of eggs and we can sell them, so... I tried selling, selling them before, but I don't think the boxes were full of eggs, so... Basically, I just um, sold a bunch of half... or not even half full. Just newly started boxes, so... I think this way we could actually make a bit of money off this. You should be able to rotate them, I just don't know how you do that. Oh, you can do that too. Broken eggs. You just pretend they're really a lot of s s padding in the boxes. So, there we have some eggs. Uh, we'll put some straps on it. We'll see where to go. So, eggs. I think, I believe this is the icon for eggs. So, best price is currently 32793. So, here, train station mill which is down there, so that's not too far actually. Go there and sell it. Let's see how much money we get. Yee, we're making money. Hopefully. It wasn't too cheap, to, I mean... What was it? 20, okay, 20,000 isn't too bad, but it did cost quite a lot more with the leveling of land. I think that's the problem. I think that if I would like something changed in FS19, that's the problem, one of those things, because everything is a little bit... Not a lot of places is leveled, and I understand it costs money to level stuff, but then there should be some way of doing that in... in, in not sequence, like... Um, well, if you have money to do the leveling, you, can, you should be able to do the leveling, not uh, just wait until you have enough money to do everything. And there's no way of actually understanding, or at least I haven't figured out how to do it, uh, how much things will cost. So, you have a price for the building, replaceable, then uh, that's not enough, then there's the cost of the leveling, which is fair enough. But the thing is, I have no idea how to really realize how much it is beforehand so 
that was the thing with the questing thing. It wasn't very expensive, but the leveling did cost a fortune, a lot. And I couldn't figure out how much money I needed in bank. So I kept borrowing money until I eventually was able to to write it. Okay, so let's go sell this. Just place it over there. So four hundred and Throw them. So four hundred ninety-one for a full box. Okay, so that's good. I wonder if you can figure out how much money you made from it. Let's see, sold and sold. Sold wood, sold bales, sold wool, sold milk, sold fuel cost, seed cost. No. I guess, I guess that's harvest income then. So, third, th th 8,150, that's okay. Yeah. It's not a huge amount of money though, but it's okay. On here, I could get out here. Sorry, it's like not the easiest thing to know where to get out. So this is Felsburn, I guess, or the town. I don't know if this is the town or or. Felsburn is sort of the town, or if it's just a farm, I, I, I don't know. You going too slow? I'm overtaking you. I wonder if there's a turn signal inside. I can hear the turn signal going, but I can't see him. Oh. That was a fuel station. Was yeah, there was a fuel station here. I went, I've been driving far up north to get a fuel station, but this is probably more close. Close. This is probably closer. There's a shop, vehicle shop. So it's a nice map. Um, my fiance commented and said, um, because she's been, she's been playing on Raven Ravenport too, she said, like, uh, Ravenport is a much bigger and more interesting map but nothing is flat on it so it's difficult to build anything I was like yeah uh, yeah I agree I totally agree with you there maybe we should sell the chickens maybe I should do something else pigs or something they seem to eat everything What do you think? Should I do pigs? This is okay, but I guess they don't eat much, so that way it's good. Wheat barley will have wheat forever. But, uh, anyway, I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, and thank you for watching. Uh, hope you enjoyed this episode of Farming Simulator 19 on the Felsburn map. And we'll see what we'll do next time. Have a safe day, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.